Ever wondered about the mysteries of yttrium, the 39th element on the periodic table? This silver-like metal is a standout character in the world of chemistry. Discovered in the year 1843, yttrium was named by Carl Gustav Mosander, who stumbled upon this element in the quaint Swedish village of Jytteby. With its unique properties and intriguing history, yttrium has carved out a special place in the scientific community. So, yttrium owes its name to a small Swedish village, but its journey doesn't end there. Yttrium might not be a household name, but its properties are quite intriguing. This silvery metallic element, nestled comfortably in the periodic table's transition metals, is actually a rare earth metal. Unlike its more famous cousins like gold and silver, yttrium is a bit of an enigma. It's a tease, really, showing off a high melting point that makes it a tough cookie to crack. Now here's where things get even more fascinating. Yttrium is a bit of a lunar celebrity. It's found in greater abundance in the moon's crust than in the Earth's. Imagine that. An element that's more at home on the silvery surface of the moon than on our own planet. It's a testament to its rarity and its unique character. And because of these intriguing properties, yttrium isn't just sitting around gathering stardust. It's hard at work in our modern world. With such unique properties, yttrium has found its way into many modern applications. From medicine to technology, yttrium plays a crucial role. This remarkable element is a key player in various industries, impacting our lives in ways we might not even realize. It's time to shine a light on this unsung hero. Yttrium is the star of the show when it comes to color television screens. It's used to create phosphors, the substances that make your TV screen glow with vibrant colors. But the magic of yttrium doesn't stop there. In the realm of medicine, it's a potent ally in the fight against certain types of cancer. Yttrium-90, a radioactive isotope, is used in treatment therapies, specifically targeting and killing cancer cells. In the tech world, yttrium flexes its versatility in manufacturing superconductors. These materials, which can conduct electricity without resistance, are pivotal in various technologies, from MRI machines to levitating trains. Yttrium also lends its strength to yttrium aluminum garnet, a key component in lasers and LED lights. Yttrium, with its diverse uses, truly is an unsung hero in our daily lives. So, what have we learned about yttrium today? We've journeyed through its discovery in a quaint Swedish village, marveled at its unique properties such as its high melting point and crystalline structure, and explored its diverse applications. From coloring our TV screens to making our LED lights more efficient, yttrium is truly a marvel of nature. Next time you switch on your TV or use an LED light, remember the element yttrium and its fascinating journey from a small Swedish village to your everyday life.